Alright, alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to City Skylines, welcome back to Nerdingham. I am, of course, the Conflict Nerd, and today... Well, today, I would kind of like to continue working on our City Hall area, and sort of expand down from this place, and fill out all this space, and get more roads in here, get some industry and all that stuff. Maybe have a look up here, I'll make, uh, you know, no promises. We might have a look up here with some more suburb or industry or something, but uh, first things first, we do have three new districts. We have Nerdingham City Hall, which is self-explanatory. We have Korriban, which I'll get to in a moment. All you Star Wars fans right now are going, I know what that is. And we have Ryan Corner. Now, Ryan Corner is named because of a comment left by Hannah Adelaide. I asked people to suggest names for districts. And she said, name the districts after people like Christopher Square, for example, the two-year anniversary of my best friend's death is coming up. His name was Ryan, so maybe Ryan Corner. So, Hannah Adelaide, there is Ryan Corner, and it's going to be staying there for the rest of forever, because Nerdingham isn't really going anywhere. We might not be doing the series forever, but that will be there forever. So, wonderful. Moving on to Korriban. So, Korriban is uh, originally the planet of the Sith. It's, if you play Knights of the Old Republic, uh, Korriban is where the Sith Academy was located. By the time the, start, the, the Clone Wars happened in Star Wars, it was known as uh, Moraband, but I will always and forever know it as Korriban because that's the name it was. That's what it was called. That's what the planet was called when I played Knights of the Old Republic, and that's what it's always going to be to me. And I think it's even called Korriban in Star Wars The Old Republic. So, you know, it, it's Korriban, all right? We, we've named a district after the home planet of the Sith in Star Wars. Really, I need to find an area to call Coruscant, which will probably be this big chunk of space here. Maybe, maybe just that area. We'll get to that at some point, though. I don't want to do that right now. What I want to do right now is uh, actually pause and make sure that we have water. So I have... Yeah, I, I really did. I really did do that, didn't I? It's been a couple of days since I last recorded, so I'm kind of trying to remember what I did and what I didn't do. Okie dokie. So what I want to do is put some office space in here. I want to fill all of this out with some offices. And that should be pretty good. And I'll do the same down here, like so. And you'll notice this road going through there. That's really just there because I could... I, I'm kind of interested to see how that looks running through the uh, two rows of buildings. And it also gave us this little space here to work with, which I really should put some parks into or something. Huh. I mean, I I guess I, I probably could. The question is, can I get this to run along new? No. Well, that's troublesome, because I can't really do there, because it's going to look ugly. So, uh, we're kind of kind of stuck with uh, with what we've got here. Unless I could get a 3x4 that'll fit in there, but I don't see that being likely. Okay, that'll do for now. We have the office space. I guess I'll do there as well, just because. And then what I want to do is just come in here with some residential zoning. Okay. And I guess along there as well. There is a good bit of residential demand, so hopefully that'll uh, fill out fairly quickly. I do like the idea of offices running down the middle there. I... You know what, I actually kind of like the idea of offices here as well. I think along this road should just be offices, if I'm honest. So that should be alright. And then I'll put residential uh, back there. And then we'll work out the rest of that. I don't want this whole space just being residential and offices. That's a weird mix of stuff. There really should be some commercial in here. But uh, because there isn't really any commercial demand right now, I think that will do. So let's go ahead and speed things up and see what happens. Uh, there are some offices and some houses going up. But they're not in great places, is the problem. Because I we don't have any electrical connection to those spaces. So hopefully they keep building down here. That's the dream, at least. That's, that's, that's the dream here. If they would build down this way, that would be just excellent. But of course, they're not going to do that. They're going to be awkward. They're going to make things, they're going to make things needlessly awkward, because that's what cities does. Thank you, cities. You always, oh, I just realized that these buildings won't actually go right back to that, uh, to that road. 
They totally would have if it wasn't the European tile set, but sure. I, uh... I guess it'll work. Can I get... No, I can't get Pyro there. Alright, maybe I should zone on the other side of the road then. That might be a good idea. What could I do? I guess just more offices. I, I guess more offices really does make sense there, doesn't it? Just up to there. Maybe not there, though. Okay, so if, if someone could build here, that would be just perfect. That really would be just great. Where have I zoned? I guess I could do a power line from there to there for the meantime. It'll keep these people happy, at least. And really, that's that's what's important. Oh, there's actually... A, oh, the traffic. I, I thought the traffic was going somewhere. They're just using my tunnel. They're, they're just using my tunnel. That's what they do, I suppose. Oh, that reminds me. I uh, changed this little area. Because traffic was having problems with this road, they were all backing up like crazy because that was the only entrance. That was, the, that was the immediate entrance to this area from the highway, so I added this in and it seems to have helped. You know, just, just doing little things. Uh, no expense was spared when it comes to Nerdingham. And uh, if you get that reference, you've been out to the cinema lately. I mean, or 20 years ago. Either or, but, you know, no expense was, was spared on Nerdingham. And, I mean, if you live here, you're not going to be eaten by a dinosaur. Again, if you understand what I'm talking about, you've been to the cinema lately, or 20 years ago. So while that's all expanding, I would quite like to start working on the edges of my city. I, uh, I, I, I enjoy, you know, I, I enjoy what we're doing here, but we do need to start looking at the, uh, the outer parts of the city to make that work. So I, I kind of want to, um... I want an angled road going that way. It's going to be another weird intersection, but it'll, it'll work. I want an angled road going that way. And I sort of just want it to go straight on. And then uh, we'll just, just make this work. It's going to be a series of grids that sort of have dead ends to them, I guess. Which is a bit strange, but... Just a little something to... Uh, sort of give the city a kind of... Edge, really. That's that's kind of what I want to do. I, d I don't want the city just ending on a straight road like this. So it does need to be a little bit, a little bit weird, but I'll make it work. So we'll do that, and we'll do uh, we'll keep that going. Then we'll go 90 degrees off of there. I could link those up. Uh, I think I'll go a block and a half that way. Then have this come across like that. And then have this go... Like... That. That seems good. Yeah, just little things like that. And then I can edge it with trees and stuff like that. That's gotta be fun. We all know how much I love doing trees in my cities. Hey, <sighs> I'm... I'm... I'm not looking forward to it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I love making my cities look good, but, no oh, trees, 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 trees are not my favorite thing. Gonna be completely honest, they are kind of far from my favorite thing. Okay, let's go from here to there. Can I get a 90 degree turn? Maybe. Uh, give me 89.4 is not good enough. That does not match up properly, and that kind of annoys me. So that's going to have to go away, that's going to have to come straight across, and that's going to have to line up properly. Line up properly. Okay, don't line up properly, that's good too. Um, how can I get an, how can I get this to, this to work? I can't really, can I? I guess that works. It's a bit weird, but it does the job, I suppose. What else can we do? Um... There is a lot of space to work with, is the thing. There's an awful lot of space to work with. Let's go a block that way. I'll go a couple of blocks that way. And then... Say... Down like that. I just need this to look... Like the edge of a city, you know? This can all be like... Semi-suburb, I guess. Which will be... Interesting to do. Uh, this can go like that. Alright, and then this can come down like that. Then this can go in there. 
All right, that should be... That'll be fairly interesting. I guess that it can't really be a suburb. It's very close to the city, but... I'll figure out some way to make it sort of work. Uh, I guess those could link up if I really wanted them to, couldn't they? I guess that works. And that could sort of come down to fill in that space. Yeah, that'll be... That'll be interesting. We can sort of edge that with trees along the uh, the outside there. Oh, that's going to be a nightmare to do in other places, but whatever. Um, this is actually going quite well. Which is nice to see. It, it is it is very nice to see. I would definitely like more zoning. I'll be honest, I would like the demand to increase a little bit. But I don't see that happening anytime soon. So let's just go ahead and get more residential in there. A bit more residential in there. Uh, not in there. That can be commercial. Uh, like that. And then that can also be commercial there. Okay, that'll fill out the space quite nicely. I guess this could also be commercial if I really wanted it to be. And I I do really want this to be commercial because I want commercial all around the uh, the city hall. So, yeah, this is going to take a long time to fill out. What do all of these things do? The medical center deals with disease. The Hadron Collider is education. That is... Yeah, that, that is uh, land value. That is tourists, and that is electricity, so there's nothing there I can really use. That is a hypermarket, which... Yeah, I mean, I, you know, a hypermarket wouldn't be the worst idea. I just don't think it really it's really needed here. What I kind of want in this area is something like a shopping center. I also kind of want the theater. The, the theater. Uh, Amsterdam Palace would be nice, to be honest. I might put that... I might make this like a palace district as well. That could be kind of nice. Or change this up a bit and put Amsterdam Palace opposite the City Hall. That could be interesting. I don't want the Gherkin. I do want a department store. Which can actually fit in there really nicely. That's tempting. That is very tempting. Or there. Hmm. I'm going to put a department store in there. I'm going to do it. There we go. Department store. That looks uh, interesting, and what I'm also going to do is just continue this road across like that, because uh, I I feel that's kind of a good idea. If I'm honest, I yeah, that should be all right. That'll hopefully get more people interested in shopping in the city at least, which would be kind of great. Do I want a cathedral? I feel like a cathedral is another thing I should totally have in here. Yeah, a cathedral could actually look really nice there. If the land wasn't awful behind it. Uh, okay, maybe, maybe, maybe not. We'll get that later. That's also really expensive. How much is that department store? 2,800 a week. Yeah, no, I didn't think about that. Amsterdam Palace is also the same. But Amsterdam Palace could totally go in there. That is, uh, that is really tempting. Okay, you know what? We're gonna do it. We're gonna put Amsterdam Palace just opposite the city hall. Yeah, that actually looks, that actually looks pretty cool, honestly. I, I do like that. So, let me get the uh, good old, good old roads here. Give me the good old curve tool. Uh, let me go like that. Let me go like that. Let me go straight road and like that. Yeah, no, I, I like that. I, I really quite like how that looks. That I mean, I don't know what that'll do. It's a, a royal palace. Visitors last week, tourists last week. I mean, it's nice. It's nice. I like, I like having this. I mean, it's an interesting choice that it's Amsterdam. I, I guess it is a European tile set, but uh, I, I, would have, I wouldn't have said no to Buckingham Palace, I'll be honest. I, I wouldn't have said no to Buckingham. But uh, I, I guess one can't always have one's way. When it comes to these things, <laughs> uh, I should never do that again. That is that is absolutely something I should never do again. Uh, let's continue. <laughs> let's continue expanding this space with uh, more residential development in there, just to fill it out a little bit. And uh, what I'm going to do as well 
is pause and do some low density residential out here. Just sort of, uh, sort of on the outskirts a little bit and see if I can make this uh, blend. There wouldn't really be low density against a highway, would there? I mean, there could be. It would just be a nightmare. So uh, I don't think I'll, I don't think I'll bother. We'll do it around there. Uh, we'll do it along there, and then this can all be high density, which will look very strange, potentially. Uh, but I'm curious to see if this works. We'll do some low density commercial in here. Okay, then a bit of high density commercial along the highway. Then a bit of uh, high density residential by the highway. Move some offices in there just to, you know, change things up a little bit. Um, bit more resi- no, maybe not in there. Uh, fix that up. Give me high density along there. Yeah, it's going to be risky, but I'll, I'll go with it. Uh, high density along there as well. I guess just all along there. And down like that. It's a weird mix. It's it's definitely a weird mix. But then just do this. Do this. Okay. Uh, maybe... You know what? Change that up. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's, let's fix this. Put the... Residential in here. Get rid of that. Uh, do that, do that, get rid of that, fix that. And then, nope. And then do low density commercial in there. Okay. Yeah, that seems like a reasonable mix. It's a lot of empty space, but that's that's fine. That'll, uh... That could be useful. I could put some parks in there if I really wanted to. Big clear park could totally go in there if I wanted it to. Don't really want it to, but it could. I could put in the 8x4. Well, I, if it fit, but it doesn't. 12 by 8 doesn't fit, and the parking lot park. Uh, well, it does fit, but I don't really want parking lots. So, you know, that's, uh, that's no good to me. That is no good to me. Let's see if we can get the 8 by 4 anywhere. I could get it there. Uh, I mean, I, yeah, you know what, we'll put an 8 by 4 park there, just because it'll look nice. And let's speed things up and see what happens. Anyone going to develop out there? I mean, I doubt it. There isn't really much demand for anything right now, but... Well, they might. They might do something. It wouldn't be the first time Cities has done something a bit weird. So, you never know. I could get lucky. I mean, probably won't, but I could. So, I'm looking at my city from above, and I'm realizing I've been quite, you know, I, I, I'm sort of forgetting about this place over here, but we'll, we'll get to that again someday. But what I'm noticing the most is that I'm being very forgetful in, uh, ooh, that's actually connected. I should maybe, if someone could build there, that'd be great, just to, just to bridge that connection, but that might take some time. Anyway, what I'm noticing is I have this big empty space, and someone mentioned that I should do another big retail park similar to the way I did in Nerdshire, which was using all the uh, UK stores that we have, so the likes of uh, Asda, b &Q, DFS, M&S, Homebase, Iceland, uh, Aldi, <laughs> Little Tesco, Curry's, PC World, Sainsbury's, you know, you, you get the idea. I should use, is that a, did I download this? Or is that in the game? That's in, that's in the game, isn't it? Okay, yeah, uh, that's probably in the game. Anyway, what I'm getting at is that that's a lot of ambulances. Is that... <laughs> I really need to not get distracted. Is that I want to do another big retail park. And I think this is a pretty good place for it, because we have a lot of residential sort of around... There's a lot of retail, actually. There's an awful lot of retail in this city. Wow. Hmm. I didn't quite notice the ratio... Like, there's a lot of everything. It's just that I guess the green isn't quite as noticeable from above. Yeah, there's a lot of green down here, a lot of green there. Yeah. Got to go on faith that I have a reasonable balance of everything. I mean, I probably don't, but I'll go on faith that I do. So, let's make a retail park. 
Let's 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 try something that's uh, a nice big big old retail park. So let's go block that way and a block that way. Let me get rid of that and let me flip that around. Let me go say how many blocks is that? Fifty units, six blocks, and done. Okay. So really, that whole thing needs to be flipped the other way around. Okay. And then what I want to do is go a block, two blocks, three blocks, uh, six blocks, and done. And then I want those to be two-way roads that cannot be parked on for there and for there. Okay, so that's a reasonable start and I am doing this grid based because it means the placement's a lot easier uh, with the buildings and all that stuff so do that that should be fine and then give me what's that 10 units I guess a block there two blocks then down I guess that could work yeah get rid of that yeah that should be fine that should be, uh, that should be pretty good. I can make this work. What I may also do is a one-way road out on this side. Just to make things a little bit easier. Yeah, one-way road out, because that way it's not going to be used as a through road. Uh, and then maybe a one-way road out on this side as well. Uh, so let me connect that up that way and flip it around. Okay, that should be reasonable. The only thing is we're going to need to get some actual zoning in here at some point, but let's start placing some buildings, and I'm kind of liking the idea of maybe doing a big old Tesco for this one instead of Sainsbury's. Uh, what other supermarkets do we have? I've got the Posh Bowl, we've got the, we've got the Mall of Moderation, we could totally put that in there. Uh, we've got Boots, we've got TK Maxx, we could put the Hypermarket in if I really wanted to. Which might actually do something, which could be interesting. This, the hypermarket is... If a supermarket is not enough, uh, this is your choice. It is everything from groceries to appliances. Oh, so that's like a load of shops in one. Maybe we'll not do... I know it doesn't make sense. I know it's not going to make a difference for uh, the game, but I, you know, I don't want to do it. Uh, maybe an Asda could be a good one. Could do a good old Tesco. Maybe just another Sainsbury. No, we'll do an Asda. We'll do an Asda. Why not? Now yeah, we'll put the Asda... Oh, it can't fit in there, really? Ooh, that's going to need a change. That's going to need to be changed. Let's see. Where is Asda? There is Asda. Okay, so Asda can go in there. And uh, this is all going to need some slight terrain modification later. Uh, otherwise, this going to look fugly. That's all right. That's all right. We can totally make it work. Have that go to there. Have that go... Uh, not there. Have it go like... That. And then flip it around. I said flip it around. Okay, so Asda is looking... Fab. It's, oh, wow. That terrain, though. This was maybe not a good place for this kind of... This kind of deal. Maybe Asda should have went down here. Now, there's nowhere I can really make this work, is there? There really isn't anywhere along here that this is actually going to look good. So, I guess we're kind of kind of stuck with it. Kind of stuck with it. Small parking lot. That's a little too small. Have I not got any of the... Did I get rid of the bigger parking lots that I had? <coughs> Excuse me. That is uh, not what I want. I know I've got these, but those aren't really UK supermarkets. Simple car, but that's the one. Uh... Give me a couple of these, just beside Asda. That will do. That that looks interesting. That looks interesting. Let's do that. Uh, sure. Let's do that. That looks awful. Goodbye to that road or path, I suppose. Yeah, that'll. No, no, that's that's an Asda. There's actually a lot of demand for uh, offices, which I'm actually going to do out here just so there's people sort of driving around and so I can sort of uh, border off this. So let me do that. Uh, and let me do 
I guess, along there as well, because there won't really be much else on it. Yeah, I, I guess offices can go there. That'll be somewhat useful. So what else can we do? I want to be in queue. I, I definitely want to be in queue. Get all those uh, tools and things that you need. All right, let's see, let's see. I want one of these roads. And I want to sort of divide this evenly. How many across is that? 30. So that should be, that's the middle there with the looks of it. Uh, that is 15 and that's 15. Yep, that is the middle. Okay. Well then I guess that should go... I guess that's fine as it is. In theory, I, I, mean, I could do that. I could do that. And I could put a few stores on that, couldn't I? I could put a B and Q out there. I could put a DFS next to B and Q. Uh, a home base wouldn't be there because DFS or home base and B and Q are kind of the same thing. Uh, pets at home could go there. Uh, carpet right could go there. What else have we got? An Argos could go there. A TK Max could go there. Halfords could go there, and Carfilm Warehouse could go there. Yeah, that looks that looks pretty good. I'm quite happy with that. Not necessarily too realistic, but it will do the job. I'll bring another path up there just to sort of link it all together. Uh, I guess technically I can link these up. Might look a bit weird. Um, there is a road there. I guess I could bring the road out a little further. Like that. And see what happens. Can I link this to the road? I actually can, which is kind of great. So what I'd like to do is perhaps bring that road to there. Yeah, that looks much better. Okay, so bring the road to there. And then I should just be able to bring this pathway in, or just straight across like that. Yeah, that looks pretty good. I'm actually pretty pleased with that. What if I did the same at the back? Yeah, that makes it look like there's more roads going about the area than there actually are, which sort of sells the illusion that there's actually uh Yeah, no, I like that. I like that a lot. I think it looks good. Now what I want to do is... Uh, oh, actually, you know what I should have done there? Is I should have used this little car park that I have along here. The, uh... This one. Because it actually fits in there pretty well. I mean, not amazingly, there is going to be a bit of a weird gap there. Which is kind of unfortunate. Or can I fix that? Could I do that and that and then find something to fill the spaces? I I guess I could. I'd rather have them beside each other to look like a bigger car park than... Uh... Hmm. Let's figure this out. What if I was to do that and that? Yeah, no, that, that, I'm good with that. That'll do the job. It fills in the space quite nicely. There's a lot... Why are there so many seagulls out here? Is it because all these are technically parks? That's very strange. There we go. That doesn't look so bad. I'm quite happy with that. Yeah, that'll do. That's good. It's got some parking. I could put some down this side, but I, I don't think I'll bother. Just because I uh, really don't want to. What I would like to do, though, is select these roads and uh, totally go ahead and just set the speed limit to be 30. There we go. Now that looks alright. That looks alright. I should totally put some trees down the side here, though, just to make it look a little better. Uh, so give me some of the big trees. Uh, so there, there, there. That's a little tree, but that'll do. Really, I probably should just put a park in here of some description. I might make one. I might make some custom parks for this area. That would probably be a much better idea, wouldn't it? Seriously. Get rid of my trees, really? Alright. Let's see how it's going to be, cities. Let's see how it's going to be. I'm actually going to just erase those anyway, because they're kind of hideous. They're kind of not great. Uh, really? You're not You're not going to give me dense... No, no, you're, you're sort of working. You're sort of 
sort of giving me dense... You're not really giving me dense trees at all. Uh, and you're giving me none in there. No, no, you're giving me one. You know, you, this, this, this tree brush is just great. Garbage is piling up, apparently. I'll forget. I'll do that later. This actually looks kind of interesting, though. I'm, uh, I'm quite happy with this. And I'm also quite happy we have some buildings over here. Okay. Let's, uh, let's do more of that, then. Let me go... There. So, what was that? That was six across. So, that is... That's 15, obviously. Uh, and that... In theory, is ten, so that's fifteen. So that's fifteen across, right? So what would be the middle of that then? That is thirty. So I'm looking for fifteen. So fifteen to there. All right. No, I. I I think this works. I really like how this looks, actually. I'm actually really pleased with this. It does look like a little uh, little retail park. And there's people parking on the roads, which they just should not be doing. They should be parking in the, uh, in the good old, uh, what do you call them? Uh, car parks. There you go. That's the word. That's, that's, wow. I forgot the word car park. I am officially quite old. Oh, that's a really cool little feature. Watch this when I when I click to move some of the cars, they actually go into parking spaces. That's really good. That's actually a good sign as well. It means that I should see these guys actually using the parking spaces. Now I love this. I'm really glad they'll be using the parking spaces. That's gonna look so good. It's gonna make Asda look great when they fill out all the parking spaces there. You know, I might I've gotta put another we got to put in another supermarket. We'll put in, uh, not an Asda or a Tesco. Well, well, actually, we need to put Maplin and all that stuff in as well. But I want to get the, uh, good old, good old Lidl. Uh, just because they'd be here. They're kind of everywhere, so it wouldn't surprise me that they'd be in this retail park. Uh, so a good old Lidl. Can go right there. Uh, probably want some parking beside it. So, is that parking? That is parking, but I want the slightly bigger one. Wherever it may be, is that it? Nope. Uh, yeah, that's the one. Give me a couple of those. I could put them across the street from it as well if I really wanted to. Do I? Yeah, I don't see why not. What else can I put there then? Have I, have I, have I got an M&S? There wouldn't really be an M&S across from a little though. I could put a Curry's in PC World. Have I got a Curry's in PC World? I don't. Okay. Right, one of my favorite shops going right there. Uh, that makes me kind of that makes, me, makes me sound kind of sad, really. I love me some carries and PC World. It's my favorite. Oh, I bloody love it. I do. Oh, carries and PC World. Woo! Seriously, carries PC World. If you want to sponsor me, go right ahead. I will take free anything uh, as long as it involves computers and TVs. Not gonna, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie for a second. Plus, look how nice I'm making your, your shop look. It's got some lovely trees beside it. It's got some nature. I mean, little, little's floating. Little ain't got shit on you. I'm trying to swear less in these videos. It's going well. Let's get a next store just there. Uh, it's not floating, which is good news. Always good when your stores aren't floating. I, uh, I like to think of that as a bit of a success, if I'm honest. Put a couple of trees back here just to hide the fact that the ground around next is awful. Uh, which is kind of annoying. There isn't really any way I can fix that without spending a lot of money in terraforming, which I just really don't want to do. So I guess we're going to be stuck with that. Now what can I put in there? Have I got a park that'll fill up that space? Um, I mean I have several that'll fill it and more. Uh, that would fill it but get rid of my pathway there, which I kind of don't want to do. But, might be, might be worthwhile. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do the plaza. It sort of connects to things anyway, so it should be alright. And I'll just put more trees down the side of it. Uh, so tree, tree, tree. Uh, tree, tree, tree. Tree, tree, tree. Yeah, that looks alright. Looks kind of nice, actually, if I, if I do say so myself. I kind of like it. Next is a little bit, 
a little bit weird. The terrain here just isn't good for this kind of thing, because the buildings sort of sink into it. And uh, the terrain is just awful, but it'll, it'll look good when it's all filled out. You'll not really notice the terrain. At least, that's my hope. Oh, dear. Okay, this isn't good. This is uh, a lot of traffic trying to go that way. It's not backing out over here. It's just backing up trying to go into the tunnel. So, traffic lights off. Uh, and let's see what happens. Like, where are you all going is my question. So I click there. You're all going into the tunnel and over that way. Some of you are coming out of the tunnel and going that way. Right, I'm gonna go on faith that you guys aren't gonna clog up that tunnel. Also, is this place okay? No, oh, no it's not. Traffic lights are causing all sorts of problems there. Yeah, I really should have paid attention to what I was... Oh, dear. Oh, wow. Yeah, no, that's, uh... Possibly why the tunnel was kind of busy. Yeah, that's uh, that's less than good. That is that is less than less than good. That may clear itself up. I mean, it may not, but <laughs> it may clear itself up. This is all uh, actually flashing itself out a little bit, which is nice. Uh, this is probably going to take its time. This place is getting a good bit of use, which is. Nice to see. I would like to get more buildings out here, though. What do we got? We have a Halfords. We have a car. We don't have a Maplin. I, uh... I kind of want a Maplin. So let me put a Maplin up there. Let me put a Boots. Uh, just next to Maplin, I suppose. Look at that cliff! That is a cliff! That is not just a road. That is an actual full-on cliff right there. And that is dangerous. That That is a... That that is a, a claim waiting to happen right there. Hmm. Let's see. Can I get a car park in there? Can I get that in there? That looks in. <laughs> That's really weird. Maybe not. Maybe maybe not. Let's see. The that's uh, a wooded park. I'm looking for the little one. The little car park. Small parking lot. What is, what is up with the sirens? Oh, why? Why are you guys... What are you guys clogging up? Is it the junction underground that's clogging up? I have a feeling it's the junction under... Yeah. Alright. Of course it is. Of course it's clogging up. Okay, how can I fix this is the question. Because there's just so much traffic trying to go that way. I might have to just clear traffic and hope for the best. Okay, well it's flowing again. I'm interested to see if that keeps up though or if it's all gonna back up again like crazy which is entirely possible but that that backlog that we had really wasn't going anywhere and you guys are all piling in there again and tailing back which is just what I want to see. Great guys. Just I, I love tailbacks. I do. I, I do love me a tailback. Uh, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'm going to set this up so these guys can't go straight on. They can only go left or right. So if they want to go into that district, they have to go to the right. Uh, and these guys are actually... That's that's fine. It's this junction is just causing all... Oh, wow, yeah. Now that, that junction is not playing well with the other junctions. So that junction is going to have to uh, go into timeout right there. And hopefully learn to behave. Or, you know, not exist. Either or, really. I guess that'll be okay. That does mean that there's only one way into that whole area now, but, uh... I'm gonna... I'm gonna hope that works. I'm gonna hope that helps traffic not tail back for miles. Because, uh, that is not what I want to see. That is absolutely not what I want to see. Okay, let's see what I can do here. Nothing really. What other buildings have we got? Uh, we have our boots, we have our maplin, we already have a lot of these. We do have an Argos, we do have a TK Maxx. Uh, I think we, have Mo we do have a Morrison's, but it wouldn't really be there. Do we have a Sports Direct? I don't think we do. Uh, no, we don't actually have a Sports Direct, which... I guess we'll add a Sports Direct, alright. Interesting, interestingly, and possibly ironically, considering I'm not a sporty person, 
I uh, almost had a job in Sports Direct. I'm glad that I didn't get that job. I'll be honest, I, uh, I don't get on with sports. I don't agree with sports either, because sports really don't agree with me. What else have we got? We've got an, have we got an m and I don't think we did put an m No, we did put an m and in, didn't we? Yeah, we had an m and That's a next. Do we not have an m and We don't. Oh! Travesty. Right, there's the m and It's not... Yeah, no, we don't have an m and This is going well. This is, this is going well. My little... Uh, do we have a DFS? We do. They've got sails on. Okay. Surprise, surprise. We don't have an Aldi or an Iceland, so I guess an Iceland can go... An Iceland wouldn't be in a, a park like that. An Iceland would be, like, there. Or, like, down here. I feel like I could put an Iceland in there. Or there. Ooh. Can I get it somewhere where it'll actually fit perfectly? Because that would just be brilliant. That'd be the best. Aha! Oh. Well, I just ruined someone's life by destroying their home. Great. Great. Gotta love ruining people's lives by destroying their home. Uh, Iceland, where can you fit that works perfectly? Where can I get an Iceland? Uh, that'll go either there or there. It's because it's a weird size. I need somewhere that's got weird sized stuff. Up here. Up here is good for Iceland. Um, I'll put it in there. Yeah, put Iceland right there. That'll cheer people up. There you go, lads. You've got an Iceland. Uh, and someone else can have an Aldi. Oh, people aren't happy. Uh, here. Have an Aldi. That'll cheer you up. Much better. So some people got an Iceland. They got an Aldi. <laughs> I mean, again, much like when I did this in Nerdshire, everyone from the UK is sitting going, I know these places. Everyone elsewhere is going, I don't know what you're talking about. This does look kind of interesting though. I I am liking it. Like the parks in there as well are kind of helping. I kind of want to put another one there, if I'm honest, and then another road up through the middle just to uh, make it look kind of like a paved area a little bit. And then just have a sort of dead end road there. Uh, maybe do the same there. Well, maybe not there, because what I can do, I suppose, is uh, put some offices along there, just to fill it out and get some buildings in there. Again, just to get people driving into the area. Uh, I should probably do the same down here, some small offices, not there, though. Uh, so there, and then some actual, I guess, low-density shops could go there. Yeah, that'll, that'll work. I mean, I, I think I'm out of shops to place. I think, I've, I think I have placed all of them. I haven't done a Sainsbury's. I haven't done a Tesco. I haven't done a Morrison's. I mean, I could put these in other places. I, I know I could, but I kind of like the idea that it's a retail part. Oh, we have some problems. Sewage and water are kind of rough. Um, I'll tell you what. I'll put a Morrison's somewhere around here because there would be another supermarket, like, somewhere in the city. Uh, if I could get a smaller, like, is Tesco smaller? No, not really. Give me a Morrison's. Where can I put a Morrison's? Right there. Or not. Why is that all abandoning? What, what is that? That is retail. Um, interesting. Interesting that retail seems to be having some problems already. I hope we're not running into this issue that we've previously had right away. Uh, because that would get really annoying. Uh, let me just chuck a Morrison's there. I guess. Yeah, we'll just chuck a Morrison's in there. That'll cheer people up a bit. Alright. Okay, now let's deal with water and sewage and possibly incineration. Uh, might want to move my sewage down river a little bit. I could move it right to the edge. I think I'll do just that. How many have we got currently? That's five. Give me seven then. So, seven of these outflow things. So, one, two, three, four... Five, six, seven, we'll go eight, because why not? Because I'm a rebel, you know. I said seven, I'm going eight. Ooh, be scared. Being rebellious. We all know what happens when there's a rebellion. Death stars get blown up and people die. And that's what happens. Let's go ahead and destroy all of these, destroy all the pipes. I mean, I could keep these, but I just want to start clearing out the uh, pollution from... Closer to the city center. 
so let me also demolish that. And go ahead and chuck in one of these, because that'll be very useful to power those things. Alright, so that'll sort that problem out. Uh, we do also need water, which I'll go ahead and grab from further uh, upstream, because we'll start moving these up this end of the city as well. We'll get, uh, we'll get a few of these, because why not? Might as well. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I will just hook that straight into the other ones that we have already. Uh, just because I'm not ready to replace them just yet. And we'll put this uh, down beside them. Okay, so that really should do with... Yeah, oh, sewage treatment just... Would it be correct of me to say that sewage treatment just crapped itself? Yeah, there we go. Sewage treatment's back up to normal. Incineration isn't doing so great. I find incineration to be an interesting one because we have a lot of incineration plants. We just seem to be having some problems. I want to get one of these recycling centers, I think. I think a recycling center could be a good idea. Just don't really know where to put it. That's the thing. I I really want to try out. I mean, we do have one. It's just not very good. Uh, so I guess more incineration is needed. Uh, so we'll put an incineration plant there and there, and uh, hopefully that'll be a bit helpful. Traffic seems to be flowing. Is traffic flowing here again? It is backing up. It is, it is backing up. Why is it backing up? Where are you all trying to go? Is it because so many of you are trying to go straight on? Oh, it's because a lot of you are wanting to go in that way, actually. Interesting. Very interesting. Hmm. I think that road's going to need upgraded to a, uh, a six lane. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that and see what happens. There we go. Yeah, there we go. That's actually helping a bit, although traffic's wanting to merge in weird ways, which is less than ideal. It's still backing up like crazy, but it is sort of bunching in a little bit more, which is kind of nice to see. Uh, still not very good at merging, though. Definitely not very good at merging. Oh, no, that, oh, that is, that's potentially helping. I feel it's a bit weird that it goes sort of like, you know, two lanes into three lanes, but it is definitely clearing out on the main road. It's just the merging is kind of the issue we're having. I think that'll fix itself, though. I think it, it's definitely flowing better on the sixth lane, although it's still backing up like crazy. Still absolutely backing up like crazy. Maybe what I need to do is not have, um... Hmm... Actually, I'm noticing that is, that's backing up because that's sort of the quickest way out of there. So maybe that should be a two-way road. That's dangerous, though. That's, that's some dangerous thinking there. Uh, maybe, let's try it. Let's try having that as a two-way road and see what happens. Uh, traffic lights seem dangerous. I mean, that makes no sense. Traffic lights are totally there to stop people from dying, but... Traffic lights seem a little bit... Yeah, because this traffic is all backing up. Because these guys are backing up because... Let me, let, me, let me show you. So these guys are backing up because these guys are stuck in the traffic that is trying to go around and leave. Which is causing these guys to back up, which is causing more of these guys. It's, it's a bit of a cycle at the moment. And I'm hoping a two-way road there might be kind of helpful. Because, uh, it's currently not doing so great. This this whole area is currently not doing so great. It was doing well, it's just that I, I, I mean, I do know the problem. It's only got one entrance to it, which really isn't helping, but... Yeah, I mean, I, I guess I could fix that with an off-ramp here. Let's give that a shot. Let's, uh, let's, let's just do something like that. Something like, well, not that steep, that's kind of ridiculous, but something like that, you know? Something that sort of comes off like that. And curves like that, well, no. But, can, can I get, an, can I get a, an angle that's not ridiculous? I guess that is alright. 
I guess it's a bit weird, but it'll do the job. Uh, go to there, go to there. Then, I guess, leave traffic lights. Oh, a lot of traffic is gonna, is gonna go that way. Turn traffic lights off and see what happens. Yep. Yeah. A lot of people going that way. It's because they're all wanting to go that way, isn't it? Yeah, that's... A bit of an issue. Might need to get rid of that tunnel, because that's a lot of people using the highway just to go to the tunnel, which I don't approve of. Although, this is totally clearing out a bit. Which is nice to see, although traffic is still having problems. I guess what I'll do is I'll upgrade this road, although I don't want to, but I will to uh, be that. And turn off traffic lights there, and turn off traffic lights there. Okay, so... That may help a little bit. Uh, how's this going? A lot of traffic using it. But that might be helping. That, that, that might... That might help a little bit. I don't know. I, I, I don't know what to... I don't know what to think. This, this is cleared out a bit though, which is nice. This is, this is definitely cleared out a bit. I just, I'm worried that a lot of these guys are using that road just to go to the tunnel, which... I guess a fair few of them are, but not all of them. Okay, we need traffic lights there. We, we definitely need traffic lights there. If it starts backing up, then we'll get rid of them, but... They're kind of needed right now. Because, uh, tra traffic isn't flowing so great, although... Uh, how many cars is that actually gonna let through? It's not going to let through enough, is it? No way. That is, yeah, that, okay, maybe no traffic lights then. Maybe, maybe no traffic lights. Maybe we'll have them there instead. Okay, so if that could flow, that'd be great. That'd be, uh, that'd be really great just to see if the traffic sort of helps itself. Probably need traffic lights there at some point. Oh, please don't back up. Please don't back up. That's a really bad place to have that join, isn't it? Let's change that up a bit. Maybe have it connect to that junction up there instead. Might be a better place. I mean, I really, really don't know. I'm really just trying to wing this and hope for the best. Uh, have that go to there. Alright, so what will happen when that goes to there? What are we going to see? What kind of traffic is that going to cause? I'm a little bit worried. Now, it's definitely coming off at a good high speed. And it's definitely... Yeah, maybe maybe no traffic lights then. And maybe I should change the restrictions on uh, the roads so that they can use the immediate left lane. Uh, as opposed to not being able to. Maybe have civilian traffic... We'll just let them all use it, I guess. I guess it does no harm. Uh, oh, that is backing up so much. Wow, that's actually causing problems all of its own. That's a little bit crazy. Yeah, that that's a little bit nuts. Why is that having so many problems? I don't get it. Let me do a one-way road, uh, one-way, obviously this one, because I can change the speed limit on it and make it into basically a highway, or at least a highway off road. We'll just do a highway, there you go, 80. Okay, so now if they want to go left, they can, if they want to go right, they can. But I need to change this so that they can go that way or that way. Yeah, and then these guys can go that way or that way. Right, so that might help a little bit. Maybe? It's it's not really. It's it's really it's it's not that effective. It's really not that effective. That's because traffic's merging. Why why is it merging? Stop being dumb. Stop being dumb and merging like that. Oh, this is not good. I'm gonna have to just no, I'm just gonna have to force the traffic back to where it was going. That's just not effective at all. Traffic's just gonna have to go back to where it was. Uh, that doesn't need traffic lights anymore. That probably doesn't either. Uh, that probably doesn't. This is all functioning. This actually looks pretty good. I like these buildings here. They do look really nice, and the office is done here as well. 
Although I just realized those are actually backwards, some of them. Interesting, interesting way to have your buildings. But uh, who am I to judge? So let's see, a lot of industrial demand. So I guess I can put some more offices up here. Uh, like so. Alright. And then I guess I could put some uh, down here as well. Yeah, that'll, that'll look good event. Oh, the traffic. Oh, the traffic. Oh, Long Johnson. Oh, Don Piano. If you get that reference, you've been on YouTube for a long time. Oh, I'm just full of references today. Apparently. <laughs> references that either everyone's gonna get because Jurassic World's just come out, or no one's gonna get because I'm referencing a talking cat on YouTube. Take your pick, really. Oh, no, this is backing up because all the traffic has to go that way. I need another, I need another off-ramp. That's what I need. I need I need another off-ramp, and it needs to be, like, here, and it needs to link to that highway in a really clever way. But I don't have a clever way. That's the problem. That That's the issue here. Can you see my problem? You can see my problem. I'm gonna have to use another one of these massive junctions here, aren't I? I really want to use the compact one, but I really don't have the space, and that's kind of an issue. That space is already occupied, it, it will let me put that there. But I really don't want to use another huge one. I really want to use the compact one, and I can sort of get it in there. That space is already occupied, so it will technically let me, so... I'm gonna take a chance. I'm gonna get rid of so much of this. And really hope I can make this work afterwards, because the problem is as well, the city was sort of built with the highway, like the, the city was built along the highways, that's that's kind of the issue here. Slope too steep. Slope too steep. Come on. Oh, come on, just, 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 just work. There's places that can, that can work there, but that's useless to me. Uh, disconnect, disconnect, give me the compact highway exit. Uh, you will work there. Now, if I do that, then what I'm getting is that lower highway is going to have to come the whole way through my... Oh, can I make this work another way? Come on, that slope is not that steep. I bet it'll let me do it backwards, won't it? Yeah, space already occupied, it'll totally let me do it that way. But that's useless, that is, that is completely useless to me. Uh, I can't really get it down there. Gonna have to put it that way then. It's gonna have to go that way and be awkward and dumb and stupid. Uh, yep, yeah, that's really my only option. I don't like it, and I know people aren't gonna like it, and I know that people are gonna complain about my road design, but I don't give a damn. You do it better. Oh, well, actually, no, don't. Because you'll actually do it better, and then you'll link it to me, and I'll feel bad, so, you know, don't. But, you get my point. I've, I've kind of designed myself into a little bit of a pickle here. Which is something I did want to try and avoid with this city, but I have apparently failed. Um, but it's alright. It's alright. We can still have a successful city. We can still make this work. This just needs to come along really close to this other road. Which totally makes sense. And then curve ridiculously sharply there. Uh, like that. And then like that. That's not good. That needs to come back a little bit. And sort of like... That. Then like... Like that. Is that okay? I feel like that's not gonna be good. I feel like I can make that a little bit better. Maybe slightly less sharp at least. I mean, I guess that's better than it was, isn't it? So that can go to there and then go to there. Doesn't really match up, but it's less sharp than it was and that's what's important. So, let's just hope this works. Give me that, give me that. Alright. 
Then give me a straight road from there. Turn on snapping. Give me a block. Give me a block. Uh, flip that. Get rid of that. Okay. Right. So now we need to make this work well. That's the problem. So get rid of that. Come on, just, just, just work with me. Just work with me, cities. I know you can do it. I know we've had our differences. I know we haven't always seen, you know, eye to eye. But I have faith that we can, together, make a beautiful road here. I have every bit of faith. I mean, I really don't, but we'll see what happens. Give me a block that way. A block that way. Okay. So I've separated those, which means traffic shouldn't have too many problems. So what am I about to do? What 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 are what are we about to see? Because that is hideous. Like, that is properly, properly hideous. But is that going to fix some of the problems that we're having? Now traffic is slowing down like crazy on those roads, which is not good. So let me up the speed limit on those to uh, 70. Right, that doesn't need traffic lights. That's going to cause all sorts of problems. What's this going to do? Uh, traffic lights there, also going to cause problems. I mean, they're using it, which is good. Uh, but we don't have power. Whoops, I may have forgotten about that. Let's connect that to there. Uh, has that sorted your problem? That has indeed sorted your problem. Good. Good, 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 good. Alright. So how's this going? This is all backing up a little bit. Just a little bit. Traffic lights sort of seem to be the cause of the issue there. Uh, where are you all trying to go? That's the question. Where are you all trying to go? I don't get it. I really don't, like, I, I, well, no, I, I can get it, I suppose. You're all trying to go that way? I guess, yeah, that's, I guess that's technically, like, the main road into that area then, isn't it? Okay, I'm gonna need to move the fire station to, like, there. No, move the fire station to there, I suppose. Uh, then the police station is gonna have to go... I guess there, that's fine. Then I'm just gonna have to upgrade this road. Cause that is still that is pretty much a main road there. So that can go right up to that point. And that'll hopefully help a lot of the problems we've been having. Okay, let me just do a little bit more zoning down this way. That is not the zoning I wanted. Uh do that, do that. Okay, so that should hopefully help a little bit. It probably doesn't help that that's going from six lanes to two lanes. So maybe just upgrade that whole thing to uh, six lanes, even though we really don't need six lanes, but sort of future-proofing it, I like to think. Uh, traffic lights off, traffic lights off. Maybe you want traffic lights on there, though. I really should have them on there, but it's just, that's just not going to work, is it? Like, at, le at least this is working and should have taken some of the load off of that place. The only thing is, I worry about how much traffic is probably just using that as a way to get to the tunnel as opposed to having to go all that. Oh my god. What are you all... Why? What has happened here and why are you all trying to go that way? It's because you're all trying... Oh, that's a way across, isn't it? So you're all trying... What? Seriously? Seriously? You're all you're all trying to go into that one lane. Why didn't you get into lane earlier? That tailback is ridiculous. Why didn't you all get into lane earlier? That just makes no sense. Okay. Well, what I'm going to have to do then is set this to not accept industrial traffic. So, uh, those, those vehicles, cargo tra uh, traffic cannot use that road or that road. Alright, so that should hopefully stop some of this problem that we're having. That'll force cargo trucks, at least, to go the other way. 
Uh, civilians, not so much, and that's... Those are all garbage trucks. Why are there... Why are they all garbage trucks? What the hell happened there? What genius dispatched a million garbage trucks at once? That's just insane. That That is... That is the doing of a crazy person. Is what that is. I don't even know. I don't even understand what I'm looking at. And I'm kind of scared. And I realize part of my problem here is that these junctions are so close together that, like, anyone coming from here has to cut across three lanes of traffic. I've made a terrible mistake. I have had a lapse in judgment. That is what I have had. Uh, so, what I'm gonna do is something a little bit crazy. I'm gonna get rid of this. I'm gonna get rid of the one that goes over and connects from that side. Uh, so people can... They can go out, but they can't go in from that side. That that may help a little bit. Oh, no. Please, just work. Just work. Just work. Don't do this to me. I don't want to have to place that junction again. I really don't want to have to place that. What the hell? Are you supposed to go that way? I honestly don't know. I guess you are. I guess you go there. I guess that makes sense. Let's see what happens when I do that. Oh, I dread to think what, what I've done. I do dread to think about what I've done here. What I've done here today. The mistakes I've made. The enemies I have, I have made. The treachery I have committed. I dread to think what... Yeah, traffic is trying to cut across all those lanes. That is great to see. That is that is my favorite thing when traffic tries to do that. Because it makes so much sense. I mean, I guess it makes no sense to have junctions that close together either, but you you get my point. This isn't going to work, is it? This, this is not going to fix itself because traffic's trying to cut across all those lanes. What if I clear traffic? Oh, I know why they were all there. It's because I cleared traffic like a million years ago. Okay, well, that makes sense. Uh, this is all tailing back. That is all still tailing back. Oh, uh, please stop tailing back. Are you These these are supposed to be good roads. These were supposed to work. I've made so many mistakes. I'm not happy. I'm not happy with this decision that I've made. This has not worked. This has been a, a dreadful idea, and I should feel bad. That is what's happened here today. You see, it all looks really good after you've cleared traffic because it sort of works for a while. But the issue I'm noticing is just all of these people that are trying so desperately. You know, they're, they're cutting across from this lane into other lanes. It's just this, it just, this just isn't going to hold up. And I know it isn't. And that just upsets me. Because I know that give this like, yeah, there we go. It's already backing up there. Which is kind of dumb. Really, like, this is dumb that this is backing up. These guys really should be going into another lane here. You guys should be going, like, there to let those guys across. Uh, these guys aren't backing up, which is good to see. Uh, definitely good to see. This just, this is dumb. This, this should not be tailing back like that. It really shouldn't. This isn't tailing back at all, which is nice. Uh, these aren't tailing back, which is pretty good. This is. That's just going to need traffic lights, though. That should fix that problem. Uh, oh, no, there it goes. There, That's it, tealing back. Of course it is. All right. Well, I don't know what I expected there. I mean, I guess the traffic lights might help a little bit. But probably not. The issue, really, is that we just have these... Uh, th these, these roads trying to link together, I guess. I mean, in theory, I... I could do something like this. Uh, something like that, and then link to... Uh, oh, there's like a pixel where it works. There's like one little teeny tiny spot where it works. There's like once there was totally a spot there where that worked. I guess that'll do. And then just flip it around. 
I mean, I, I know that's dumb. But in theory, that'll stop traffic from doing this. And I'm not going to keep that, don't worry. That's not something I want to keep there. I just kind of want it there until I can sort out the problem that I'm having here. So... I mean, if traffic could stop being dumb, that'd be just great. Yeah, quite a few of them are actually using that. Okay, I'll allow it. I, I, will, I will absolutely allow that. This is clearing out, which is good to see. Okay. Well, in that case, what if I... Hmm... What if I had that? What if I change this up a bit? Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Uh, and then change that into that kind of road. And then have this not connect to there, but instead connect to there. Because no one's really using that inside lane. And most of that traffic, yeah, that's actually working pretty well. That's that's pretty good. I'm quite happy with that. That'll do the job, and it doesn't look anywhere near as bad as what that did two seconds ago. Although traffic here is backing up quite a bit. That's troublesome. But I guess I'm going to have to deal with it. Yeah, that that's something I'm just going to have to deal with, I suppose. Not... Not entirely keen on traffic backing up, but there really isn't anything I can do about it. But at least this is all working. At least this is all working. And it does look dumb. And it does look hideous. And I really... You know, looking at it, I could build this and do it in such a better way myself. And I probably will. Uh, is this backing up anywhere down here? Uh, a little bit of a traffic jam there, but that's okay. I think we're good in the rest of the city as well, which is fantastic to see. Yeah, no, I I think we're good. I do. I I think we're looking pretty good. So I'm gonna leave it there for today, ladies and gentlemen. What I've 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 sort of been uh, thinking about cities content lately, and I've decided that uh, we're gonna go back to how we did cities when the game first came out. We're gonna do uh, daily city skylines videos for a little while. Uh, all your other favorite series, you know, Tropico and The Sims. And things like that will be continuing, but what we're going to do is have cities every day as your first video, and then we'll alternate the other videos as your second video for the day. So that's what's going to be happening. Since everyone seems to be enjoying cities, I want to give you more of it and have an excuse to play more of it. So that is the plan there. But yes, with that in mind, I am going to leave it there for today. Thank you very much for watching. Perhaps I should say thank you kindly. I've been the Conflict Nerd, this has been Cities Skylines, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye